Hey guys, I've got an awesome app to show you today. It's called Beautiful Icon Styler and it allows you to change your icon pack on your stock launcher. A fair number are supported including the Google Now launcher, TouchWiz, HTC Sense and the Motorola home screen. And the best thing, this doesn't require root or any exposed module. So yeah, let's take a closer look. I should mention I'm using the full paid version. It was around 50p or 99 cents in the US. There is a free trial version, but it only allows a maximum of three stylings. And as always, all the links are available in the description below. The app itself is really well made and it's very simple to use. You can see that it's recognized the Google Now launcher. The first tab here is the icon packs I have installed on the device. The next tab gives you the ability to change the individual icons. I should mention this is only available in the full premium version. And we also have get free icons. Basically, it gives you some of the best free icon packs available in the Play Store. It also links you directly to them if you press get it. And we have get premium icons as well. Same deal, but this time it's for the paid icon packs. Now, I said it was very simple to use and it really is. All you have to do is hit that apply button. You'll see this little uh, pop up appear and you'll, it basically says if you add any more icons, you will have to reapply the icon pack. And in some cases, you have to force stop the launcher or restart the phone. But right now, we're just going to hit check it out. And you'll see, there we go, the icons on the home screen have changed. And they change completely on every home screen you have. What it doesn't do is change on the, or inside, I should say, the app drawer. You can see the icons in the app drawer are the same as stock. So hopefully that will come in a future update. But right now, it only changes the ones on the home screen. But it works very well. Now, if you want to revert the icons, you can press the three-dot menu and hit revert changes. You can see a little uh, toast that says done, go back to the home screens and there you go, it's changed back. So really simple application to use. It doesn't require root, which I know a lot of people will be happy about. And let me just go ahead and show you this on the Galaxy S5 as well to show you that working. Okay, so we're in the application on the Galaxy S5. You can see it's recognized TouchWiz Home as the launcher. We'll go ahead and hit apply on this icon pack. This time it says styling, please wait. We didn't see that on the Nexus 5. It takes a little bit longer, but you still get the uh, TouchWiz Home style, the same little kind of blurb we saw before. So we'll hit check out, but you'll notice the icons haven't changed. These are still the stock icons. So you have two choices on the Galaxy S5. You either have to restart the device or you can head over to your application manager, go to running, show cache processes, touch with home, stop. Then we'll go back to the home screen. So it's basically restarted. And you can now see it has styled those icons and we now have those icons available to us. You can see the phone hasn't changed there. So if we go into the, uh, the application here, you can go to the one by one and you can change the phone to basically anything in here that you want to do. So you can pick this red phone icon it says styling again, you are going to have to go ahead and restart the launcher every time you change on the Galaxy S5. I'm not sure why it's doing that on the Galaxy S5. All I know that is doesn't do it on the Nexus, but you can see once restarted, that icon is going to go ahead and change. So yeah, it's pretty awesome if you love to style your device, but you don't want to change launcher or root your device. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Peace out.